MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. Samsung is a household name for many things, and that includes machine tools. I'm here at Emo 2015 in Milan. I'm on the Samsung stand, and I'm going to have a quick walk around and look at all the machines that they're showing. And I'm going to start with this vertical lathe, which is a PL800V. It's a fanet controlled machine, and if you're a manufacturer that's looking for vertical turning capabilities, this is a machine that you can look at. We've got a 10 station turret on this machine and you can see here we've got turning capability, drilling capability, boring capability and the actual swing of the 800 is 890 mil diameter and the max turning diameter of this machine is 810 millimeters. We've got a 2000 RPM spindle on an A2 spindle nose and it's a pretty quick machine with 20 meters a minute in rapids. So, as we move away from the vertical lathe, we're next going on to a very impressive machine. This is the PL45LY. This is for manufacturers that are looking to turn uh, larger components. You can see here this particular machine has a Y-axis which is actually in operation at the moment. This is a really impressive bit of kit. It's a solid machine, uh, a box guideway construction machine and well, you can see by looking at the component being held uh, in the steady on this machine that if you're a manufacturer that's looking to turn parts similar to this, then the PL45 is, is an option. Then, we move down one further. This machine here is the PL35LM. So there's no Y-axis on this machine, but you can see the L stands for a long bed. So if you're looking for a, a two-axis or a three-axis turning center with a, a large turning length in, for capability, then the PL35 is an option. This machine has actually got mill drill and it's driven by a fanet control. You're looking at 12 to 15 inch chuck. So we're now onto smaller machines on their stand. We've got the PL1600M, which we've looked at uh, in, in, uh, in Brighton at Dugards before. But this is a small machine. You're looking at around about a 300 mil turning diameter. The machine here has actually got uh, the mill drill capability. It's a compact machine, great for subcontractors. There's actually a, uh, a three jaw chuck in here. And you're looking at, again, between sort of six and eight inch chuck uh, with an actual bar capacity on this machine of 46 millimeters. We've then got the SL2500M, which is a new machine uh, from Dugards here. You can see we're actually doing some, uh, some gear cutting on this, on this particular machine, which is quite a, quite a novel demonstration. Uh, no Y-axis, but if you're looking at mill drill, turn in centre, the SL2500 is another machine that's on show here. Moving one machine further down, we're now onto the PL2500SY. Seen this machine before, very popular in the UK. Subspindle machine, the Y axis is in operation here. It's an eight stroke, 10 inch chuck machine. You've got a parts catcher, and the second spindle here gives you the opportunity to do one hit machining. You can see the Y axis uh, in operation here uh, and, and the milling. Uh, on the 2500 Y, you're looking at a swing over bed of 650 millimeters and a turning diameter of 360 mil. Onto the last machine on the stand, this is the SYD200 T2Y2. This is a twin turret machine uh, turning center. It's a twin turret, twin spindle. So again, really for one hit machining, if you're looking to complete components quickly and be machining on the front spindle while you're machining on the back spindle to reduce uh, or eliminate downtime and make parts quicker, then the SY D200 T2Y2. It's also got Y-axis on this machine. Uh, this is this is the last machine here on the stand. It's a very impressive stand. It's a it's a it's a, been a busy stand here today. And this is the Samsung stand at Emo 2015. For more videos, products, and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.